Welcome to this Devico training video. Here we will present our DeviCore BBT core orientation system and its use during core drilling. The DeviCore kit consists of two instrument units that are fitted to the inner tubes, a core barrel extension, a PDA that operates the instruments, a core level for orienting the core, a set of wrenches, and two spare batteries. It is possible to run core orientation with one inner tube, but is more efficient with two as described in this video. Start by removing the check valve and ball from the two head assemblies in use. Assemble the valve and the ball in front of the DeviCore units. Attach the head assemblies to the back end of the DeviCore units, as shown here. Then, attach the inner tubes to the front end. The core barrel extension may be fitted between the front reamer coupling and the core barrel. The DeviCore units are set up to be used in a specific order, starting with the unit marked 1. Press the green power button to wake the PDA from sleep mode and move the magnet rod into the fitted groove in the DeviCore. The light will start flashing rapidly for a few seconds until the PDA heading says DeviCore. Press the survey button to start the core orientation. Here you may enter the borehole name, for example test and adjust start time and time interval by pressing the plus and minus buttons. When pressing start, the core orientation will be initiated and the full inner tube assembly is ready to run into the hole. In water-filled boreholes, the inner tube may be inserted into the drill string and dropped. In dry holes or holes with a lower water table, the inner tube should be lowered with the wire line and a dry release should be used. When the inner tube has landed, the drilling may commence as normal. When the run is over, stop the drill string rotation and reduce the water flow. On the PDA, enter the bottom depth of the hole and press the mark button. Wait without moving the drill string until the mark button turns green again. When this happens, you may pull back the drill string to break the core. Be careful not to rotate the drill string until you are sure the core break has occurred. The first orientation run is now finished and you may press the stop button and retrieve the inner tube. While the inner tube is being retrieved, the second DeviCore unit may be started up. Use the same procedure as before to connect the DeviCore to the PDA. The parameters will be the same as in your first run. After pressing start, the DeviCore is ready to run in the hole. When the first DeviCore has been retrieved, the second may be run into the hole and drilling initiated. Place the first DeviCore and the inner tube onto a steady surface and connect it to the PDA as you have done previously. When connected, the load button will activate, allowing for download of the orientation data. The results will be presented in a table with a green background indicating a good quality reading and a red background indicating movement during the measurement process. Press the core ORI button to read the current position of the DeviCore and rotate the full assembly until the red and gray arrows align. When aligned, move the core lifter case and place a mark on the top or bottom of the core 
whichever specified by the project geologist. Use the core level tool for additional accuracy. Once done, press back, then continue, and wait for the ongoing run to be completed. Continue to follow this process step by step until the end of the shift or until core orientation is no longer necessary. When the core orientation is no longer required, press the finish core orientation process after the final mark point has been taken. This allows the data from the first Debbie core unit to be downloaded without having to initiate the second unit. At any time during the orientation process, you may export the orientation data to a USB memory stick. Insert the stick into the USB port and press the export button. Select the appropriate file format, set location to hard disk, and press save. Remove the memory stick when the screen changes and press the back button to return to the main menu. To replace the batteries, use the provided wrenches to first loosen the rear section of the Devi core. Unscrew the rear section to expose the battery cover. And then unscrew the battery cover. Make sure to put the battery in as indicated by the arrow on the packaging. Check the O-rings for damage and apply grease as required. Rotate the battery cover until it is finger tight. Then use the wrenches to tighten the rear section of the Devi core. Devico, your worldwide exploration partner.